there remains ample room for improvement. This is where the productivity capacity index becomes particularly crucial. By providing a comprehensive analysis of our strengths and potential areas of growth, the PCI enables us to target more effectively our efforts to improve productivity. To highlight the significance of productivity in our context, let me share some statistics according to the World Bank. Jamaica has seen an average GDP growth of around a modest growth rate averaging between 1% to 2% annually in recent years. And I submit that this cannot bring us to the point of prosperity, which we all seek here in Jamaica. However, to keep a pace with global advancements and to ensure a prosperous future for our citizens, we need to boost our productivity significantly. The PCI therefore serves as a key instrument in this endeavor, helping us to identify crucial areas for intervention and to track our progress over time. These tools support the developing countries in understanding the status of productivity capacity, and more importantly, how we plan to improve it. I also note that PCI covers 194 countries and map 42 indicators. Interestingly, and I guess this goes to the validation, the PCA has been peer reviewed, receiving various accolades, of course, and has validated this particular service. So let us utilize this opportunity to exchange ideas, key ask questions, and collaborate towards a common goal, a more productive and prosperous Jamaica. Looking at the components of PCI, I was particularly intrigued. Human capital, national capital, energy, transportation, ICT, institution, and structural changes. I personally find the structural changes to be of tremendous importance. As it refers to, of course, the movement of labor and other productive resources for low productivity and high to high productivity. One of the things that has plagued us over the years is our low productivity rate. So this, this um, component I'm particularly interested in to see how we can utilize it as best as possible. As I said before, Jamaica has suffered low productivity for a long time. Therefore, using these tools and zeroing on this aspect will definitely provide us with infinite cases to assist us at both the national and the firm level. Jamaica significantly now has the lowest unemployment rate in our history at 4.5%. And now needs to address more than ever the concept and the activity that deals with productivity. Our productivity has been low. So it assists us in a dynamic way considering all aspects of production Thus, the tools at PCI and those tools can help us. Therefore, I look forward to a most rewarding and stimulating conversation on PCI, knowing well that it's in our best interest to grow our GDP per capita and our productivity. As we can see, that there is a direct correlation between productivity, sorry, between PCI and GDP. So thank you for having me here and I look forward to a fruitful and enlightening discussion.